Hey y'all, today we're gonna do a little Ormond Beach Zillow review. More of, a, not really a review, but seeing what houses are for sale in Ormond Beach. I'm pretty sure this is one of the cheapest beach areas in Florida that's on the East Coast. But, so a lot of Florida on the East Coast, I'm just gonna zoom out a little bit so you can see the map. It has like river on one side, land in the middle, and then ocean on the other side. That's a lot of Florida East Coast. So as you can see, this whole bridge right here, is river on this side, ocean on this side. Obviously, I'm, I'm just explaining it. Right here, there's nothing, obviously. We're going up here. Okay. So it starts around Villano Beach. And then it starts heavily in St. Augustine. And then basically the, the entire state. I think it took us Miami, maybe. So we're in... What's it called? Ponce Inlet. Cormor Beach. Cape Canaveral. Satellite Beach. Palm Bay, Melbourne, Wasabo, Vero Beach, South Piers, Huxton Island, Squad, Jensen Beach. So as you can see, I think it ends. Oh my God, it keeps on going. Okay, it goes all the way past Miami, Highland Beach, South Inlet Beach. So basically, all I'm trying to say is, it, this is an all East Coast Florida. It's like land, uh, and we're going to Ormond Beach. I kind of lost Ormond Beach again. And I'm just going to do Orm Beach. I think Orm Beach is kind of interesting. I think it's a cool area. I just discovered it recently. I'm probably going to take a little trip there to see if it's actually good. But Ormond by the sea, I actually looked up. It's actually unincorporated um, land. So that means you don't really vote for mayor. There's no mayor. Satellite. Okay. So Ormond Beach is a pretty cool area. Because right, all right here is all just natural grass. And this is the only area in all of Florida, on the East Coast, keep in mind, I need to be clever for that. This is the only area in the East Coast of Florida on the beach that actually has miles and miles of no houses and only trees. This is very rare, because so many hotels want to be here, um, so much houses, so it's kind of cool how they're actually giving this uh, a little um, nature area. We have a swamp right here. There's a super cool location at that. But we're just gonna see what's up, bro. That's basically it. We're just gonna see the cribs. Hopefully, I don't have a. Okay. I'm gonna do no limit. I was doing 350,000 limit just to see, like, cribs. So we're gonna start in this area over here. And our first little condo. Actually, I don't. Yeah, I'm gonna do condos, whatever. This two bedroom, two bath condo, 1200 square feet. You know what I'm saying, bro? A 750 HOA fee, bro? Bro, you can't, bro. You need to pressure wash your roofs. Pressure wash your roofs before you win that price. But the beaches in Ormond Beach are probably beautiful. Oh, it's a private beach? That's oh, rare. This is a... I really like Ormond Beach. These houses look a little newer. Let's see what year this was built. This was built 1973. It's been there for a while. I want to see when this house was built. This one million dollar crib. 1999. So, okay, so Orman Beach has been here for a while. And there's a, a $280 annual fee. I hate HOA fees. Why is this HOA? Like, what? Is there a gate? Just HOA for no reason. It's just this is a really weird neighborhood because there's actually not many stores, it seems like. It seems like most of the... And there's no bridge to get, there's no like stores on the other side of mainland. You have to drive pretty far just to get some civilization. Like the main area. Yeah, dude, you're in, I like it. I like the, I like the privacy area. We're getting a little distracted, or I am getting distracted. Oh, uh, what? It's actually a good deal for that $1 million house. $24 in one, but I don't even play. I want to see like the the selling info. Oh, price history. No, this is taxes. Wait, what? Where is it? Oh, here it is. Sold for whoa, nineteen ninety nine for fifty five k. Then the guy who bought this only two years ago. Two quick and easy years, dude. Two thousand, two thousand one, or even a year and a half. Made twenty thousand dollars. You think that's a lot, right? 
She made 20 grand in a year and a half. No, bro, the guy, another guy, two years, made a hundred grand. So if I offer this guy, now he bought in 2003 and he held, dude, what? Who's taxes? So it was worth this much? In 2007, it was worth $280,000? And in 2012, it's 60. That's a huge. That is mad insane, bro. Look at that old car there. Oh, whatever. That's it. 0 0.3 acres, quarter mil, bro. Okay, let's see when this was built. 2007 vibes or no? 2016 vibes. I knew it was older. I knew it was newer, bro. This is a cool crib, though. How much do you watch this person bought it for? Sold. 2017. Oh my god, 400,000. This guy made some good money. Okay. So we're gonna do this lot right here. Oh, this is a beachfront property? What? Is this buildable? Why is no one buying this? Like, you have... Oh, okay, I'm kind of dumb. So it's not beachfront property. It's across the street from the beach. That's the only downside. There's actually no beachfront properties in this whole area, now I think about it. This is... This is beachfront. No, it's not. It's across the street from the beach, bro. It's still nice. Don't get me wrong, but it's not beachfront. There's a road that you don't own. It. So this is $600,000 for this crib. Built in 2000. Let's go. Y2K. Yeah. Dude, I just love this like terrain, bro. I love that there's no city in the background. It's just swamp land. Like, Oregon Beach, actually, is pretty... I'm going to visit here tomorrow. I'm just going to... Bro, it's a long drive. I'm from Florida. This is probably like two hours away. It's dark night. Van Gogh. Van Gogh paintings, bro. I love that. This is a very 2000 style house. Look at that old um, VCR. Nice kitchen. This is, you can tell this is definitely updated later on in life. This is definitely like not 2000. Nice kitchen though, definitely, you can tell it's probably like 2007, early 2000s. Nice cat, I'll probably just keep it, I don't even care. A hot tub, bro. Dude, this crib's such a good crib, bro. Let's see how much they bought it for. So in 2009, they paid almost a quarter million. And now they're selling for like over double. Dude, that's insane, dude. You literally like doubled your money for living in a house near the beach. I want to get to the cheaper cribs. It's kind of expensive around here, but this is a 3D tour. This hoe is three bedrooms. Oh, it's oh, it's 79. It has a house plan. This was definitely remodeled and updated recently. This is a nice house. I love the kitchen. Yeah, I love the the kitchen. This is a really nice kitchen. This is a modern house, even though it's from the 70s. But every door, everything is like newly updated. This is a very new house. I really like this style. I want to go some cheaper houses. Whoa, bro, bro. Come on, get me back to Ormond, bro. Am I back in Ormond? Okay, good. I need satellite imagery. Sorry about that. So, now we're in like, this area is like the... The prime area, I would say, gets more quiet. That's just my opinion. I've never been here, so I don't even know what I'm looking at. But, oh, what's this? I'm sorry. Someone just has a big house there. Okay. Purple roof? What? No, it's a purple roof. Oh. It's a purple roof. They painted it purple. That's weird, bro. 196k for a lot. I think I'd rather have the. I'd rather pay fifty thousand dollars more and get that huge lot in that community. That's way bigger than this. That's a that's a rip off, in my opinion. I wonder how much I paid for that. I should have checked it. They no history on Zillow. 
client looking at MLS. And now let's look at his $1.3 million beauty. This is a beautiful house, man. Built 1999, heat pump. I live in Florida and I don't know what a heat pump is. That's terrible. I should know what a heat pump is. I'm from the state. Newly designed bathroom. This is fucking beautiful, man. Farm. Oh, I love these doors. It's like farm style, like rustic. Yeah, this is a cool vibe. I don't like a wire right here. I'm very picky about that. I just don't like wires hanging like that. It's just disgusting. That wire is okay. I don't like all these. I'm really picky about like the decoration, but I don't like all these like pictures hanging. It looks that's crooked. I don't even know why I'm typing pictures in the wall. That's not in the crib. But oh, let's go back. Um, backsplash. Oh, I love the rope. This is a really nice bathroom, dude. Oh, I love this type of house. This is 1999. This has to be like older, bro. This is like older style. 80s and 90s trivia game. Why is that here? That's just not. That ruined the whole house, bro. I'm, I'm gonna delete it now. I'm just kidding. Them kissing as they're dancing. Yeah, they're like country-ish, kind of. They're country beach. They're definitely not from Florida. Her design this house is not from Florida. They think they're from Florida when they put the palm tree, tree um, chairs. But they're, they're, they're not from Florida, bro. These guys are from, like, the Midwest. Her designed this crib. I'm actually, I'm actually bored of this crib. Oh, 300k? For a lot, kid? Don't play with me, bro. Okay. House type? Nope. Oh no! I want to see these lots. So this one's across the street from the beach, 400k, which is a fucking ripoff. Right so for like a hundred thousand dollars less, it's no still across the street from the beach. Just so build a taller house than this guy. All you have to have is like a, a three-story house here, so you can see over the beach from the other guy. So this fake beachfront, this is not a, this is not beachfront we're looking at. This is across the street from the beach, and this house is nowhere worth 1.2 in my opinion. I mean, it could be. I don't. I don't know where, but I'm just saying like, no, this house is 1966. It's brick. It's ugly. I'm sorry. How much did I pay for it? I bet they had it in the family for years. Let's see. Price change. Price change. Dude, they've been listing it. It sold in 82 for 90 grand. I bet that was a lot. It could be a full curve, who knows. But 90 grand. What? Oh, report. Price change. So it never sold. They just keep on listing it for the last, like, listing removed. Why do they keep on listing it? Listing for 500,000? 500? 525, 525. Took it off for a while, then COVID happened. Dude, I don't get these people, bro. They keep on, they're like, I don't even get these people. They just don't want to sell the house. They just want more than it's worth, no matter what it's worth. It's probably permanently for sale. I don't really care about condos. Is this like a 2023 crib? Yeah, 2023. This, I'm not gonna lie, is not my color style. I don't like the blue and the hat. Like, if it was white, this house would be phenomenal. I just don't like that blue. It kind of ruins it. The doors, like, really 50s style. I love the stairwell, like this. California style. Very empty, but this is too, um, like, formal. Like, it's like hotel vibes. Yeah, this is like the, the the new style for houses. This is the most modern style choice. Nice bathroom though. Dude, these oh okay. These are gonna be outdated, I'm telling you, bro. These these are so expensive. They ruin the roof. And they just don't look that good. Like, they're okay looking, don't get me wrong, but it's like, I don't really want that, dude. Like, 
You guys can be outdated next in like 10 years. This is all new style. Like th this style is seeing the screws. They like when you see the screws. I don't. This is a weird painting, but this is a modern painting. I like this painting a lot. Modern how I love these handles though. And this handle right here. Oh, we got G eight ninety. Genesis. They're, they're valid for Genesis, but the fake palm, the fake palm tree could actually just like ruin the crib. Bro. I didn't even see that when I first saw the crib. Why would you get a fake palm tree, bro? You're in Florida, on the beach or across here from the beach, whatever you want to call it. This house is way too modern for me. I like this closet though. My own cat. Fan. Everything about this house is modern, 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 modern. This is screaming. You're in the decade of 2020 for a life. Like this is just the decade. I wonder what 2030 is gonna be like. Hopefully, like what if society just sticks with this for life? That'd be terrible. Nice little garage. 69 photos. That's a bonus on that beat year. The classic stairwell with vintage, but they're bringing a lot of vintage stuff back. But this is hideous. Why do you want a metal palm tree on your property? That's just disgusting. It's gonna. It's probably stainless steel, but still, it's disgusting. Like that's just. It's an eyesore, bro. Like it's a metal tree. That has like um, te what's it called? Like a, like a telescope thing, bro. That just ruined the whole curve for me, dude. I'm sorry. The driveway is kind of cool, though. I like the truck better. The metal palm tree, dude. Remove that. That's a good view, though. Whoa, okay. That's a perfect view of the island. I could not see the island before, but now I can. Now I literally can see it perfectly, bro. This is just... It's actually beautiful. It's actually a beautiful island that you can look at. And then you don't see any buildings. You just see straight in swamp nature so this actually is a cool crib don't get me wrong it's a little bit too modern for me too new and i don't like the style as much as other people do but i like the lights up here why don't more people have lights up here like that's actually really smart the sidewalk just cuts off right here this is just disgusting i don't know why you don't put more bushes instead of just that one tiny pathetic bush I can't believe they actually bought a metal palm tree. I can't believe that. Now we're getting some cheaper cribs here. This is still a good crib. This is 87. I like this a lot. I don't know why. It's just very cute and like cozy. The bushes are perfectly cut. It's not too fancy. It's just you're living in a crib in Florida. They got the brick two-tone accent. Oh, look at that handle, bro. That's a that's a rusty handle. That's when you know you live near the beach. And that's copper, too. You see the, the green and the corrosion. That's copper blend. And some metals. We're not in history right now. Or science. So we're in, you know, this is a vintage house. This is not dated. New furniture. Oh. That's fake. That's why, dude. Is that fake? I can't tell. I think this is fake. I actually can't tell. It's really good. No, it has to be fake. No, it's fake. Yeah, it's so shiny right here. Yeah, it's fake. I don't like how they keep on like getting. This is a cool kitchen. I really like this kitchen, but they need to get rid of a new granite top. That granite top's ugly. What the heck is this up here, bro? What the heck? Bro, don't play with me like that. The skylight? Okay. 
The skylight again, okay. The skylight again. This ugly ass closet, bro. The old. This is like so 80s. This is so vintage. No one has closets like this now. Ew. Oh, it's beach seesaw. Okay. Okay. It's not that bad. It's beach side. It's actually a unique mirror and the light. I like that. And this. It's unique. They update a lot of the house. And they don't update a lot. It's kind of a weird crib. The fans are just outdated, bro. Oh, okay. Box in the room. This is ugly, bro. This is this bathroom's not been updated. This is old, bro. Is that everything in the house? Oh, wait. We didn't get to the back side of the house. So, after the bathroom. Get the nice garage. I like to paint in the garage. It's a nice crib. Don't get me wrong. I like that fence right here, too. Beautiful garden, which if I ever lived here, I'd probably die instantly. I would never water them. Nice shed at that. Nice pavers. They they know what they're doing. But I don't know why someone takes care of all these plants and just like leaves them. It's a cool crib. Is there a pool? No, the neighbors. So I guess you can like, when the neighbors aren't home, you can probably use your pool. It's really close by. Beach access. Beach easement? What? I don't know what beach easement means. And that's your crib? That's a thumbnail. You see what I mean, bro? Oh, beach access easement. Comes with two people on the beach. Intercoastal waterway, and your crib is right near the intercoastal waterway at that beach. Yeah. Dude, Ormond Beach? Bro, I slept in Ormond Beach, bro. Why did I not come here? There's no partying here. There's no, I don't see any bars or. I don't see any Walmarts or Targets around here, bro. But it's a nice beachside living, bro. Yeah, condos. I don't mess with condos. Since I don't mess with condos, we're taking them off the list. I'm just trying to see straight up cribs. San Jose Drive. 21. 21! It's not bad. Three beds, two baths. Honestly, at this point in the video, all these houses are starting to look very similar, especially this one. All the modern 2020s, like, new decor. Maybe it's just a beach theme. But I do love it. Like, don't get me wrong, I love the decorations, but it's just, like, better palm tree. Yeah. We're just getting to the point that they're all the same, but this closet it puts the other closet to sleep with those stupid metal bars. This kitchen is kind of ugly and outdated. This room is just trash. This room is obviously a cool room. They just put these chairs for no reason in here. I. Atlantic Ocean. Ha, e fax. Bro, what? Community fishing dock, end of street. That's a dock for fishing. Pretty dope. Beautiful suns. Dude, I want to go to this island. Beautiful sunrise. Beautiful water picture. Beautiful. Ormond by the sea, bro. I hope I pronounced this right. Honestly, guys, if you guys like this video, which no one's probably going to watch this because no one watched my videos. But if somehow you guys manage to watch my video, I'm going to go here and record myself go here after the video. Even though no one's probably going to like get this far in the video. like I doubt anyone's going to get this far. If you do get this far, comment pirate. Just say straight up pirate. Or pirate. 
Um, Orman. Pirate Orman. Say pirate, bro. I don't even care, bro. I just want... I don't... I just truly don't believe that anyone is gonna watch this far. But I'm, I'm making the content no matter what. I'm happy to make this. I just generally just love looking at Zillow. And this house is just small. There's not much to it. Look how many pictures there are. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve picks. It's a small crib. Let's see how much you pay for it. Wait, 1966? 1959? Oh, it's sold in 23? For 200k? Oh, bro, what? Bro, stop playing me, bro. They bought this crib five months ago. And they're trying to sell it for 100k more? No, you cap. It literally says tax assessment $160,000. That's a weird crib. I don't trust it. Oh, this is a small crib. I like it. It's 50s. 1956. Like the carport. This is very outdated house, bro. This is very outdated. Look at the old tile. Yeah, the old fans. Whoever buys this house is going to completely redo it. Yeah, they're gonna get rid of everything in this house. They might keep that granite top. That's pretty nice. And the fridge and the stove and all that. Okay, the cabins are pretty good. Okay, the kitchen's okay, but they need, a, they need a backsplash. What the heck is that, bro? What the heck? That's like a... What am I looking at right now? What? Is that like a shiver pole? Is that a big chair with a big pole in front? You sit like a... Is it for giant babies? Like, the legs go in between, like, the big, um, like, beam right here, and the light. I don't even know. It, it could be a fireplace. This is just ugly. This needs to be removed. Why is this in the house? And why did you take pictures of it? No one... Like, this just has me really confused right now. I don't know why anyone wants a pole right here. You know what be really funny? Is having a couch right here. Oh, I'm, like, pointing the screen. Having a couch right here. Facing here. And having the TV right here, having the bar in between the TV. That would just be funny as fuck. This is so... This is my exact bathroom. That's so weird. So I actually live in a 1954 crib. And my bathroom came pink like this. This exact style. Um, it's same pink color and the brown on top, which is really weird. But we actually painted all white. Because fuck that color, dude. Old fan, dude. Some of my buy it's vintage AF. There's not really much to say about this house. It's just a small crib. It's not the most glorious thing ever. It's 300k. Let's see for sale. When did the person buy it? I don't know when they bought it. But I think that's a ripoff. This one's 325. Ormond Beach, 32176. Newish. Newish. I really like this back patio. It's actually really cool. They each have a screen, though. They folded on not having a screen, though. What the heck is that light? Blue door. Blue door at that beat. Blue door. Hot water heater. 423 a year in case anyone was wondering. Energy guide. This house is mid. Oh, oh my god, dude. Why am I so bad at this game? Wait, what happened? Satellite. Is there anything that's cheaper than 300,000 here? This is 309. Price cut on the 15th of September. They need a mother lawn. That 1953. I can just tell. The 50s were booming, bro. This, is, this house is too small to even take more than 10 pictures of. No! I'm so sorry, guys. Even though I'm saying sorry to myself. Because no one's going to be watching this for. Hashtag pirate. Call it pirate. You heard me? This is very 
I'm just trying to see what this is. I don't know what the middle part is. Is that like granite? Outdoor granite? No way. There's no way it's actually granite. That's, a, that's actually a rock slab. That actually looks really cool, the driveway. But what year was this? 1956? Nineteen fifties style cribbo. I don't know what this clock is. That's kind of hard to see. A nice little outdoor bar. Okay, that's dope. Cool area. Ugly office, but it works. It works. I actually fuck with this house, bro. How much bedrooms is this? That's very dirty. Like, put your, put your clothes away. You're going to take a picture of the room, bro. Like, come on, bro. Don't even play with me. A nice little storage room. A little bathroom, bro. At that. At that. Nice little car. I like this house, bro. How many bedrooms is this? It's two. There's no way. There's, I've seen way more than two bedrooms. I don't know, bro. Come see this awesome bungalow style beach style house, bro. I'm orbing by the sea. This unique home sits on the street of a perpendicular two to road, two bedroom, two bath, plus an office. This home has a brand new AC, hot tub, hot tub. You heard me. Enclosed patio room. Outside area has a large shed and two storage units. Well maintained. Must see at that. Got a hot tub. So it seems like it has been getting a little cheaper in this neck of the woods. Maybe because there's no island. Even though this is the dream right here, this house. We haven't even seen this house yet. Blue turquoise garage and door at that. Nice little living room areas. There's three beds. I like this house. It's probably my favorite one so far, even though it's outdated. But I don't care, bro. I'll update that hoe, bro. I'd rather be updated by me and some random like 2020s guys who obsessed with 2020 so much that he's gonna make a house out of the 2020 style. I like that. That's vintage. I don't know what house. Oh, I love the green lamps. I need that green lamp. You know what be really funny? Trying to go on Zillow and like buy um like items in the list. I contact the real estate agent like. Hey, I really like that lamp. How much? You want the lamp for? Um, I give you four hundred bucks, or I can get a real estate agent, literally, to contact the other real estate agent for a lamp. Video idea, bro. I'm not actually gonna do that idea. I don't even care, bro. Get have a realtor. Like, I want to buy. It. I'll I'll pay I'll pay thousand dollars. I'll pay twelve hundred that light. Just because I want it. Oh my god, bro. That's an insane painting. That is just exquisite. That is exquisite at that, my lady. That's a cool painting. Luckily, it's on this video for life. Can I zoom any more? I, you have this side of painting and this side. Pirate! Murph, shit. This is really ugly. Nah, bro. I don't, I don't like this. This is torque. Ugh. Why is a lamp in the roof in the bro? Oh my, I'm about to throw up. I'm just gonna be a headache even looking in that room, dude. So everything about the house I like. 1958. It seems like more houses were built in the 50s. What year in Florida had the most houses built? Wow, I spelled that wrong so bad. Wait, what year in Florida has the most houses built? Wait, houses built? I don't get this. Alfred and Olivia. I don't. 
know what page I'm on right now. Wait, what am I? I'm on Wikipedia. I'm uh, Alfred and Olivia Tharp's illustrious house. Yeah, I'm just gonna look it up later. That's that's very odd. You see that? You see that right there? Alfred and Olivia Thurps. That's whack. Okay, we're just gonna back. We're just gonna do a couple more houses before I wrap this video up. I'm actually gonna. Yeah! Yeah! Okay, so a lot has changed in the last one second. But, basically I paused it, went to the bathroom, saw a beautiful sunset, had to go there for 30 minutes. Anyways, we're back, it's dark, uh, it's actually nighttime out, the sun's away, and we're just gonna do a few more. I didn't give an outro, you know, I know none of y'all care, but I feel like I'm obligated to give an outro. Um, Two million dollar hoe, six baths, you already know this is a mansion, bro. So this looks like a good, it's the, this is 79 picks. We're doing this one, one more, then maybe another one, but confirm two more. Wait, what house, what year? This is crib. So this is 1950. A 1950s style crib, let's go. So we're on the river. There's a nice, bro. Why do you have a penis pool? I'm sorry, bro, but. Why would you make a pool? That is literally a penis. Like there's literally the stairs on the top. I, I'm taking a picture of this. I'm sorry, this is like. This is like a picture worthy. Here, this is a better picture of it. Oh, so you see, wait. I can't really zoom in on Zillow, so I'm zooming on my phone. You see the stairwell? The stairwell's a tip. Like that is just a disgust. That pool actually ruined the entire house for me. What the fuck? I'm gonna post that real fast, dude. That's actually a good post. That's whack. I don't know who designed that. This is phenomenal. I love this. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful at that. Like, the pool doesn't look as bad when you're in it. I get their vibe they're going for. They were trying to make you walk in this area right here. All right. Have a little hot tub in this area, then have a little like chill out area so you can see the river. I get what they're going for, but it just made it look like a straight penis. Like. You have a dick in your backyard, bro. I would remove that pool. I don't want that pool. That's actually embarrassing. Dude, I love this wooden rustic style, bro. This is like so unique and quirky. I don't know what this mailbox is. I don't, I don't know. I don't know if this is vintage or not. But the doors look Hawaiian. Or in beach, bro. Put everyone else to sleep, bro. On God, you. Exquisite band album cover. It's up to date. It's all up to date at that, bro. This is a beautiful house. Beautiful. Okay, that just okay. This house isn't like perfect. Wait, what? Am I looking at? Is this a? This is just a. The weirdest computer setup I've seen in my life. So the guy took his. I'm like, this is like my exact reaction to this. So some guy has some like weird desk. Like I'd never seen a desk like this before. It looks like an organ. And then he thought it was a good idea to have two keyboards. He has an actual keyboard. For playing music. And then he has a Titan keyboard. So he has two keyboards. 
and they're both different keyboards. That's the weirdest desk I've seen. Here's another angle of the desk. Just so whack. Oh, look at that vintage picture. I still want to make a video of buying pictures from people's houses. Like, hey, I want to get a real estate agent. I hate my client. Really likes that painting. And the bathroom on um, picture 79 out of 70. No, 37 out of 79. And we really want to buy that picture on the wall. It looks vintage. We want to give you an offer of $1,200 in USD currency in cash. This is ugly, bro. How old are you, dude? How old are you, kid? What the heck? Bird that? Wait, 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 wait. This is disgusting, vintage, old, ugly. Get out of here. This is... I like how they painted that and that. This wall is a super unique color. I like the color of the wall. A wooden room... This is outdated. This is a very outdated house. Like, how are you gonna sell us for two million? Like, this is super unique. Don't get me wrong, but still, two million, bro. You gotta like. I guess you're gonna. Whoa, you got caveman paintings. That's dope. I do like this house though. It got a little pirate themed bar. So this is Ormond Beach, Florida. You got a penis pool. I still don't understand the concept. Like that right here. Like you, you don't like look at the pool and be like, like this is a wrong angle. Like the the balls right here, right here, right here, and right here. And this actually has an affection right here. <laughs> okay, enough joking around. That's a cool crib though. Don't get me wrong. But that house and that house is way. That house is better. Up the right here, bro. That house puts all these houses to sleep. Penis. Pool. Dude, I just... It looks like a fidget spinner. At the same time. It looks like a fidget spinner, bro. Like, just get rid of that ugly pool row. Beautiful, beautiful front and backyard. Don't get me wrong. Alright. Last cheap crib. I want to do the cheapest crib in Ormond Beach. Wait, they have beachfront cribs? In I'm sorry, y'all. We're doing this last, this is the last mansion, bro. This is phenomenal. This is just 1990. This is 1994? What? Someone has 94, bro. This person was... Holy shit. This was in the 90s. So this is a very rare like occasion. This is a 1990s modern style house. This house was 30 years of advance. Because houses in 2020s look like this. And this was built in 94. So houses that are built in 2024 next year, bro. Next year. <laughs> it's backwards. But um, I'm just going to look at this house, bro. I just can't believe this is 1999. Like, how rich do you have to be to live here in 1999? Like, holy shit, bro. The master architect? No way, bro. This house was literally in a magazine in the 90s. That, no way. That is so cool. I mean, this is a... F Dude, this house is actually famous. I wonder what makes this house so famous. $5.99, it's old then. Magazines are $15 now. That's so cool. Yeah, but this house was ahead of its time, though. Th this is such a beautiful house. This is so ahead of its time. And this is so modern. Yet, this was in the 90s? So whoever was the architect on this definitely had an idea for the future. And all rich people have the same art. Wait, what's this? This is inside the magazine. 
Dude, this house is a magazine. That's actually insane, bro. Ormond Beach, bro. On the charts. But they have Coke bottle. I want to look in that so bad. Okay, this is my favorite house I've ever seen, actually. Like, I was capping on it at first, but the fact that this was built in 1994 and not 2024, like, like, that's how, like, my standards are like, I'm just, loud and clear. That's my reaction to this house. I'm just like, this house is actually perfect. Like, this is actually a perfect house, in my opinion. The chair, like, everything's so artistic. I dream of having a house that is as artistic as this. I love this table. I need to be an artist, bro. I need to be a furniture artist. Because I can, I want to make something like this. Or that, it's a pretty good idea. No! I lost my train. Okay, now we're up here. This is really ugly. I don't know why they... Okay, I want to see that glass case so bad, dude. I can't even look inside it. Come on, bro. Cut playing, bro. Beautiful house. Like, you can tell this is 90s, like... This is so advanced 90s that this is my favorite type of 90s vibe. Okay, if I was in 1994 in this house, I would just feel a different way about life. Like, I'd be like, I don't even know. Like, this is just phenomenal. And every time I look at these houses, I'm thinking, of, like, of the year I'm in. And this house has not changed in the 90s. You can just tell. This was just so far advanced. Whoa. That's probably, like, rare-ass swords in there, dude. No way. That's actually, a, dude, this house is just mind blowing to me. I don't even care. Cool art, but I wouldn't take it. I wanted the Coke bottles. Like, you take a picture of like some like random like lines, but you don't take a picture of actual Coke bottles that are in a glass case that are probably like rare. The stereo I do like. I love the wires. I don't know why I like this shit. I am not a fan of this. The dots. This was a 90s thing, probably. They probably thought this was going to trend, but I can tell what 90s this was. This is more modern style. If this bed frame was from the 90s, I would freak out. This is unique. Never seen anything like this. This is like such a unique house. This was in the magazine. It's in Ormond Beach, Florida, bro. You, I just love... Okay, so certain houses, you get, like, a certain feeling when it's a certain decade. Especially the 90s. Because the 80s... When, don't get me wrong. It's just someone dealing with the 90s is, like, when they actually changed in houses. And the houses became so much better. In my opinion, I could be wrong. I mean, in my opinion, I'm right about my opinion. But it's just something different, bro. Like... You can tell this is 90s, but it's not... It's outdated, but not too outdated. It's a point you kind of like it. I, I like it. This is a very odd pattern, but I like it. It probably looks grainy in a picture, because this actually is not 4K. This is definitely 720p. But this was 4K. I bet it will look a lot better. The stones have just too much detail in them. This is a pretty cool door, too. Dude, beautiful house. Like, what? Imagine showering in this. You got a little bench. Cool room. A Squishmallow. <laughs> Squishmallow! Oh my god, wrong hand. Wrong hand. Okay. Squishmallow. I got one too, bro. Dude, just... I love this right here. I love, like, just the indents right here. This is ugly as fuck, bro that this is kind of outdated the the metal poles not gonna lie it's kind of outdated i love the fences that they go down the 90s was just different bro like 
That was a different, like, culture decade. I really like that decade. This I don't like about the 90s. That's just disgusting. A lot of stuff in the 90s is kind of bad. But a lot of it, like the high-end, classic. If you were filthy rich in the 90s, you had amazing life. I think, I think being rich in the 90s is better than any other decade. Cool, cool. This table is pretty cool. No, um, I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting used to these pulls. I still would rather not have them at all. I think it looks better without them, but whatever floats your boat. It's a weird rocking chair. So this whole bench is just for you to look out. Like, hey guys, welcome to the party. Here. Hey y'all, welcome to the party. Yeah, welcome in. That's why I'll be like right here. I'll be like, hello my friends. Wait. Okay, I'll be facing this way. Hello my friends, welcome to my party. Vodka la me. That's what I'll be like if I was in a party type beat. Yeah. You gotta view the Coke bottles. So this guy is a confirmed Coke fanatic. He's a Coke addict. Um, Coke Attic has in Coca-Cola all over. He has a bunch of Coke stuff. That's probably a vintage bottle. I just want to see that so bad, dude. To zoom in that hole, bro. Orin Beach Opoly, bro? Bro, they're literally on the maps. Orman Beach, Florida Monopoly, bro? That's actually insane, dude. That's actually, like, really cool how they put that in that picture. Don't everyone know that their name's on the maps and they don't play around, bro. Dude, this house. This is perfect. I need a bridge in my house. Like, imagine having a fucking actual bridge in your house. And you have a freaking jungle in your bed. Dude. I need my lottery ticket right now. So I have a small chance of winning this crib. Everything about this house, bro, is just so nice, bro. But the only thing I have a question about is what does this couch do? This couch is not the perfect spot. Like, it looks really good. Don't get me wrong. It looks perfect, but it doesn't really serve a purpose. Like, what are you going to do? Sit there and watch the beach or watch people swim? There's, like, there's no TV. Like, I, I want a more of a hangout room, like a lounge. Like, I want, I don't know. But it's not cluttered, which I like. It's very open. I, want, I don't know. I just want more, I don't know. I actually don't even know what I want. This is, to me, this would be a good dining room. That's where I'll put a dining room there. Beautiful. I don't know what this dot is that's smoking, but it looks like that one emoji that's red. Whatever. Camera. Dude, more Coke. This guy's a Coke addict. I'm telling you, dude. He has Coke decorations in his crib. Oh, my God. Look at that nice kitchen, dude. Such a nice kitchen, bro. I love this. Dude, this is modern style, bro. And this, they, this is in the 90s. That's insane. Professional cooking. Yeah, Coke. This guy just loves Coke for some reason. A nice workout room. Which is actually a terrible workout room. Because there's only like one running thing. It needs more equipment. But still a workout room at that. Oh my goodness gracious, dude. Stop logging me out of this thing, bro. I'm almost done, dude. This, this, this looks 90s right here. Beautiful mansion, dude. But this house is like so perfect. For just gatherings and meetings. Like, it's just, a, this is an art. It's an art house. I don't know, this is water or glass or lights. Like, this is a unique sink. What is, is this a sauna? 
What is this? Wait, what am I looking at? There's like a wetsuit up here and like flippers. Like dive equipment. Like, I don't know what. Is this a shower? Dude, this house is actually perfect. I just love the fact that it looks modern and it looks 90s at the same time. Like, how can you have something that looks 90s and 20s at the same time? No, I don't know why I did that. I'm just very excited for this house. That's a terrible picture. This branch needs to beat up a little more. This is a beautiful picture. Look at the the moon, the sun, the stars. This is this looks fake. Right here it looks fake. It's a filter. I'm I'm so stupid. I don't know what to say anymore. This is just a beautiful piece of art. And the steps are rugged. God, dude. And it has a dolphin, bro? No, but I love these rugged steps. It looks like... It's not supposed to be there. I love it. This is the best beach stairs i ever seen in my life. Like, single-handedly in my life. And this picture is 720p or 480, bro. This is a... What am I look What... I don't know what this is. Wait, is this another house in front of the house? It comes with a free guest house, dude. That's actually insane with the same style and vibe. And it's a hangout room. It's a studio hangout. It's for guests to sleep with a... Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer? What the fuck? That is just whack. But you can tell this is 90s, too. Like, with the vibrant colors, randomly. That's such a 90s-like thing. What the heck? I, I'm always curious what these rich people that own these mansions collect. So when I look at these Zillow videos, I always like to see what they're collecting. And I, it's, this one's really bad picture. It's like just really bad quality. And we can't zoom in the Z Zillow pictures. It sucks. They collect a bunch of Russian dolls right here. This random stuff that... It's just random. Okay. A lot of artwork with the similar art style. Oh, black and white checkered. That's rare, dude. I like it. The black and white checkered board. Bathroom. That's rare bathroom, dude. Wait, what? What is that? Is that a sink? That's super low. You didn't... I don't even know, bro. I don't know what this is. That can't be a sink. There's no way it's a sink. Sink's right there. That, a bidet, bro? What the fuck? Koi fish farm, bro, with bamboo. I like that. I like that. I love the rocks, how it's over a little bit. There's a weight limit on this. And I'm not even exaggerating, actually, is. Turtle, turtle. Well, it's actually a, a, a weird picture to take, but okay. Now, this is what I wanted to see. Wait. This is inside the house the whole time? Oh, this is outside? Oh, so it's kind of... Oh, okay. Oh, okay, so it's outside but has a wall, so it's, it's private. The walls are pretty high, though. Nice private hangout. 90s slash 20s. Oh my god, dude. If I lived here in the 90s, I'll die. So these other houses, they're not bad, but it's like, this house is like so glamorous. It has perfect grass, perfect pool, in magazines. It's just a perfect house. And then all these other cribs are just like, yeah, we're normal. We're on beach. There's still million dollars. There's still million dollar cribs that are huge. Don't get me wrong. But they're not artistic in art style like this. Like, all the grass is dead. This just costs a lot. Like, dude, the house sticks out. Like, no matter what angle you look, it sticks out as an art piece. as a mansion. As a... That's why I clicked on it, bro. 
I almost ended the video before I clicked this, and now I'm happy I, I just clicked it. McLaren? Okay, whatever. Who cares? Wait, Ormond Beach? They have Ormond Beach limited edition soda, bro? No, I don't care that much. <laughs> but that's actually pretty cool, though. Ormond Beach, 489 Oceans. No way. No way. For this house literally has a Coke bottle named after the house address. 489 Ocean Shore Boulevard. 489 Ocean Shore. Ormond Beach. This guy is addicted to Coke. He's a Coke addict. I'm telling you, bro. This is a Coke. Whoever let's hear is addicted to cocaine. Not cocaine, but Coca Cola. I don't know why I said cocaine. I meant Coke. But that's insane. He might do cocaine, who knows? But that is just mind blown. He has a Coke bottle that says his address on it. Share a Coke with Ormin Beach. Four eight. Like, did someone show up at his house and be like, hey man, like. Like, hey man. I got Pepsi, that's embarrassing, dude. Someone like gets this Coke bottle and they're like, Ormond Beach, 489 Ocean Shore. You know what? Share a Coke. I'm going to go there and deliver the Coke to them. At that. So I'm just mind blown at that. I don't even care about the McLaren, bro. And who cares about those stupid glasses, dude? That's actually a cool place, bro. Now I care. Daytona International. Golf. That house is 10 out of 10, bro. I don't even care. That is a masterpiece. Like, I'm just happy to even be lucky enough to look at it. Let me see the last one got sold. It sold in 2020 for 3.2. What? Sold in 2001 for... Wait, wait, wait. Let's see. 1995. It was built in 94. So half a million. And then a year later, the person lost money, or six months later, lost money. And now they're selling it for less in six months later? What the heck is wrong with you? Like, this doesn't make sense. This guy's a fucking idiot. And then this person, only in, like, six years, made, um, or five years, made, um, a million more. That's just insane. That's pretty much it for this video, guys. Y'all have a good one. You heard me once, you heard me twice.